chill here. We're gonna have fun and just soak up the pee. The rest of the days we're gonna figure it out. Not sure what we're gonna do, but really this is what we came to do. Just chill at the freaking beach and veg out and relax and get away from people. <laughs> but there's people everywhere. Nevertheless, I'm in paradise. do is just build my acting career and I feel like I will live like a nomad because it would take me from set to set to place to place to country to country I mean at least that's my dream I get to experience the world you know and be a kid and stay being a kid cross my fingers that that would happen one day because then in the future I can be the breadwinner and my boyfriend he would just quit his job and he'll just travel the world with me and I'll do my acting he'll just come with me on set and bring my kitty cat and we'll be one happy family and like that's exactly how I would love to live like I'll be the working person and he'll just take it up he's worked so hard in his life already that I don't really care I just want him to be happy you know Besides, if I'm doing what I want to do and I'm happy and I'm making money and I mean, what else do we need? As long as we have our health, we have each other, and I have my daughter, and I have my career, we're good. Here goes Daisy. Good evening. I'm having my nice Girl, eat. simple chicken with my salad, a couple of nuts. Having shrimp, chicken, some clams. We gotta take, take in our protein and our veggies. There you go. No sugar. Kind of interesting though that New Zealand is like one of the most beautiful places in the world, and then the people are so nice, and then the people are so big. I don't know. It's amazing they are, but it, you know it's so natural. I mean, like if you see native New Zealand people. And they're not like strapping in today, you would think they're going to go on with them. So, they're, like, even a grandma. The grandmas are like six foot and change, and they look great. They look like, it doesn't look like they're. If they were smaller, it would look weird. <laughs> it's like the weirdest thing. It's like amazing. Like the 12 year old kids are like all six foot tall. I don't know, at least the ones, native ones of see. Not the, the Caucasian ones, the darkest skin. They look really, really ginormous, I don't know. I can't see the food, I guess. I just wonder, like, what's the uh, lifespan over there? Because I hear, like, the people yeah, that live the longest question, is yeah. in Sweden. Yeah. I, I, I think no, it was, like, actually, Swede, no Switzerland or something like that. Recently, I heard it's more like Asian, and not Asian no. per se, like, like Asian, or when you think Asian, a lot of people might think uh, like Asian, like Chinese and Japanese, no, Asian, like in Fiji and stuff like that, those are like... Oh, no, you mean Polynesian. Polynesian, okay, I stand corrected. Those people I heard, they live a long life too. I think I think the trick to, to living a long life is just living life. Yeah. You're right, but it also has to do with the yeah. environment the culture you know and the lifestyle and the, food, yeah. the quality the of life that they the live food. i think the food is the most important thing probably bet that new zealanders live longer than us just because of their lifestyle and how chilled they are and how wonderful they are as character and they live they live more of a stress-free life but most important though all of that said and done is the food you have yeah, to but have stress to. also plays a big role. And I agree with you 100%. But I I think the thing that's killing us all in, in the U.S. is killing us all in, in the Western civilization is the food. I think we get out of the U.S. and you don't get food that's contaminated by that. Even in Europe, they have so much more better standards in the food than we are. And we're kind of similar with with the way things are run with the government and stuff like that. And um, I think it's just the food. Well, it's both, I guess. It's stress and yes. it's food. It's, a, it's definitely hand in hand. And people, the quality. True. 
The bottom line is that we need to move to New Zealand. <laughs> what you doing? What are you getting? He's getting the mango breeze. I already had the red widow. There's my music. There's their music. Arrival to the second place. We came over to the all adults place so we can have some peace and quiet and swing away. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> I am so elated. We switched places and I'm so freaking happy. I'm wearing my pink happy dance shoes. Ah! All right, babe, so we arrived at an all adults place. Does that mean we have to play like adults? Yeah, we're big kids. So let's get ready to play our 